Greetings and salutations. This short presentation talks about flash floods in Arizona and how to stay safe when out and about during the monsoon. My name is Glenn Sampson and I work for the National Weather Service in Tucson, Arizona. Thunderstorms routinely produce heavy rains during the monsoon which flood low-lying areas of a road. When approaching a flooded roadway with flowing water, always remember, turn around, don't drown. This limerick is the most important message of this video. The majority of flash flood deaths in Arizona are associated with vehicles entering water. After entering a flooded roadway, the driver loses control when the vehicle begins to float and everyone in the vehicle is swept downstream. Turning around and not entering the water can save you and your loved ones from drowning. So don't forget, turn around, don't drown. Let's look at the leading causes of weather-related fatalities in Arizona. As you might expect, heat is the leading cause of death. This is followed by flash floods, dust storms, and lightning. Therefore, flash floods are the second largest cause of weather-related deaths in Arizona. This picture is a typical example of what happens and is of a flash flood which occurred in South Tucson. As you can see, flash floods may occur when least expected and on the normally dry roads you travel every day. When do most flash floods occur? This bar graph shows the number of flash floods which occur for each month of the year. January is on the left side of the graph and December is on the right side. As you can see, the months of July, August, and September have the largest number of floods. These floods are associated with monsoon moisture over the southwest. From the last graph, we know the months of the year when most flash floods occur, but what time of day are they most prevalent? This next bar graph shows how many floods occur in each hour of the day. The left side of the graph starts at 1 a.m., noon is in the middle, and midnight is on the far right side. As you can see, the frequency of a flash flood begins to increase around noon with a peak in activity between 5 and 7 p.m. After 7 p.m., we see a slow decline in frequency through midnight. While this graph shows when most flash floods occur, the other important aspect of this graph is that it shows a flash flood can occur at any time of the day. As with any type of hazardous weather, the best action to take is to go inside a building. The best method for staying safe during any severe weather is to not be out in it. If you don't need to be outside, stay inside. If you are out and about, be aware of the weather forecast for that day. If the threat of thunderstorms is increasing, this information helps maintain your safety awareness. Keep track of what weather is occurring nearby by listening to a radio or simply by taking a cell phone with you. Many cell phones automatically alert you when a flash flood warning has been issued for your area. These phone alerts are based on the location of the phone, not your phone number or billing location. Most flash flood deaths occur in vehicles. When approaching a flooded roadway or low water crossing, remember, turn around, don't drown. Be especially careful at night when water depth and road conditions are harder to see. Take the time to find an alternate route. People won't mind you arriving late when you explain to them you are avoiding being a flash flood fatality. This picture is of the damage a July storm caused to Silver Bell Road near Tucson. As you can see, a flash flood will not only sweep vehicles downstream, but can completely wash out sections of the road. Many times, a driver may be aware of water flowing across a road, but they cannot see that the road itself may be gone. Please remember, turn around, don't drown. For the latest weather forecast from the National Weather Service, you can check the website weather.gov slash Tucson. Additional monsoon safety information can be found at monsoonsafety.org. You can also find the National Weather Service on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Be sure to remember, turn around, don't drown. Hopefully you found this flash flood safety information useful and will have an enjoyable monsoon. Take care and be safe.